Live continues with your host, Amy Sparopoulos. Summer parties, like those on the 4th of July, always bring out the best foods, but are they really good for you? Our local YMCA, Millington Family YMCA, they're here this morning to share summer food swap tips along with Fire Chief, Millington Fire Chief Gary Graves to tell us how to be help, safe on this 4th of July. Welcome this morning. Good morning. Chief, good to have you. Welcome. Thanks for good to have you, my friend. We never hardly get, you're always so busy and going, going, going. So thank you for joining us. Glad to be here. And Lizzie with YMCA, thank you so much. So, you know, I guess it is, well, not I guess, it is certainly top of mind to remind us all about the do's and don'ts, not only of eating, but of firework safety. So, Lizzie, let's start with you. What do we need to remember when we go to that 4th of July picnic? Yeah, so just some quick tips. So first tip, ditch the bun, use lettuce. Oh, so yeah, that's good. I, I know so, some people may disagree, but yeah. <laughs> lettuce is always a good alternative to still get the meat in there and get all the toppings. Yep. yep. Um, use lean meat so you can Very find good. these at your local produce. Um, go easy on the oils. If, yep. if you're anything like my family, my dad likes to grill with a ton of olive oil. Oh Granted, my gosh, I know. Yeah, so it, it's my very healthy, but at yep. the same time, too much is, is too much. Too much is too much, absolutely. Um, Use frozen yogurt instead of That's ice cream. You can tip. also load on some healthy alternatives such as fruit. And then yep. choose grilled vegetables. So take advantage of the grill. They taste a lot better on the, the grill. They do. You know, I saw a friend of mine told me uh, grill romaine lettuce, cut it in half mm. and put it on the grill. It was delicious. We did yeah. that a few nights ago and it was fabulous. So Chief Graves, I know you've got some things to, for us to remember too about fireworks. Millington is having a great fireworks show and Talk a little bit about people taking on these things on their own. We are. Uh, Millington has our annual Flag City Fireworks Celebration on July the 3rd. Okay. Gates open at 4 o'clock at USA Stadium. It's a new location for us. Uh, oh, it's our sorry. second year at USA Stadium. Uh, but, you know, the fire service always wants to remind people that the sale and use of fireworks is illegal within Shelby County, and particularly in Millington. Yeah. Um, but we do recognize that people will go to our neighboring counties and buy fireworks and, you know, celebrate the 4th of July with fireworks. But there are some pointers that uh, they need to remember as far as using, uh, yeah, tell using me about fireworks. That. Um, Look sparklers, at that. Sparklers reach over. Sparkler reach. You know, those things you can, you know, kids buy them and stuff, and, and the tip of those things can reach over 1,000 degrees Fahrenheit, oh, which, which can cause some severe burns. Yeah. Um, if you are going to use them, uh, we've had some hot weather, which is kind of dries out the grass and things like yeah. that. Uh, so be sure to have a water hose or a, a bucket handy with water in it. Yeah. And never try to relight any malfunctioning fireworks or anything like That's that. That's a good tip. Uh, you know, those things uh, can, yeah. can malfunction and, and cause some harm to you. And this is interesting. Don't buy if in brown paper bag because they may not be legit. They could not be legit or they could uh, be some counterfeit type fireworks and they'd be more than what you're, do what you're buying for. Yeah. Um, you know, we encourage people to attend the public displays. You know, all the municipalities around are having different displays throughout yeah. the 4th of July weekend. Um, and, uh, you know, there's over... These fireworks cause a lot of fires, yeah. and um, you know, anywhere eight across the nation, you know, twenty thousand fires. My sister was burned one one Fourth of July um, by some fireworks, and I mean, it was not. It, you know, don't ever give them to your kids, y'all. This is just silly. Right. Do not give them to your kids. Uh, the Fourth of July fireworks for Millington is the third, which so is July, Tuesday. Tuesday night, July the third. Gates awesome. open at four o'clock, USA Stadium. That's fabulous. You can find that and all the information that Lizzie was just talking about at the YMCA Memphis.org. There they are. You can follow them on Facebook, like them on Twitter. Thank you so much for joining us, Chief. Lizzie, great to see you, my friend. Eat the watermelon, not the M&Ms. We're back after the break. <laughs>